Thanks for helping us celebrate Asian American, Native Hawaiian, and Pacific Islander Heritage Month by sharing some of her favorite Japanese comfort foods she grew up with. That's right. And joining us now is the host of Wabi Sabi podcast <laughs> and best-selling author of Hinsugi Wellness. Please welcome Candice Kumai. Thank you so much for being with Thank us. Thank you, Amy and TJ. Good so to nice you. to be here. Well, you Can't are wait. starting, I believe, with one of TJ's favorite things, tea. He drinks Thank it every you. morning. Yes. yes. Very zen. Uh, yes. yes. So the cool part about All Japanese right. green tea is it helps to keep you calm. It helps to keep you focused. This is matcha tea, as we know, which is huge right now. It's full of L-theanine, vitamin C. Okay. You take this, you can make a latte with a little collagen, a little matcha love, and all you do is you add it into here and whisk. This is a cha wan and cha sen, hmm. a Japanese set. Traditionally, this is how I love to drink matcha in the morning with my family in Japan. And we oh. just really zen out and enjoy life together. This is a roasted green tea, if you'd like to try it, called sure. hojicha. I absolutely would. Thank it you. It is a little bit lighter on the caffeine. These are teacups from my grandmother in Japan. Oh, wow. And it's beautiful. a very nice... Yeah, it's light. It's a tea with a very faint oh, hint of that roasted tea leaf. Yeah, it's oh, full, that's good. full of benefits like phytonutrients, good for immunity boosting, and say in the middle of the day you want a little pick-me-up, rose tea, unsweetened tea is the best. This is the rose tea, right. a little too. sample. Oh, you are talking to me here, yeah. Candace. I no love sugar, it. I love right? It. The tea's tea, it. rose mm. green tea is mixed with roses really and good. sencha. Mm. Mm. Right? And you can just pick it up at the store. We like to tell people if you want to change your life in five minutes, Drink green tea. <laughs> right. Done. Okay. Easy, right? right? We probably should get to cooking because something's cooking there. What yeah, I was going to say, I didn't want it to burn. Okay, so this is shiitake mushrooms, onions. We're making our spicy miso ramen. Oh, okay. Okay, my mother is from Kyushu, Japan, which is a place where she says that we have the best ramen in the world. This is a little tahina paste or tahini. And then we're going to add miso, which is Japanese fermented soy, good for health benefits. We're basically making, in other words, in French cuisine, you would call this similar to a roux. roux yeah. Exactly. And then what you would do is you would mix this down for a little while. This is the soup base. We're going to deglaze the pan with Japanese mirin, which is a rice wine. So you're gonna get the bottom bits of the pan up. And oh, then wow. once this cooks down, and you guys can smell the essence of the mushrooms, oh, getting a the facial. onions. <laughs> yes. The tucky facial. See, relaxing. <laughs> now Amy, the facial. <laughs> okay, so next up, we're gonna add the hot water into here. And what we'll do is I'll show you this when it's all done. It will look like oh, this. Oh, wow, it's beautiful. We added a little hot sauce because some people oh. like mm -hmm. it spicy. Now, how long would this whole mm -hmm. thing take us to cook here? That's a good question, mm -hmm. TJ. I would say if you're at home with the family, this will be about a 30-minute meal. Wow. Okay. We've got fresh ramen noodles. These are different than what you would normally find. They're called sun noodles. They come in a little package like this. Oh. They're fresh versus the dried stuff, which means they're higher quality. And they're real Japanese noodles from a Japanese family. Oh, wow. Yeah. And Sprouts, then, onions, spinach. Right, a little spinach, a little bit of egg. Whatever you would like, the Japanese say, you know, do it your way. And then togarashi, this is a spice, is the last to top off. So because my mom hails from southern Japan, she says, Oh, yeah, our uh, ramen is the best ramen. <laughs> so, <laughs> she taught me very well. And in Japanese culture, we also like to say itadakimasu before we eat a meal to show that we appreciate the chef, the veggies, the farmers, everybody uh -oh. that was part of the meal. And then when you're done, you say gochiso sama deshita, which kind of means like, thank you so much for this meal. Uh, they are very graceful in their etiquette, and I think it's cool that we get to share a little bit about my heritage That's today. beautiful. I love the gratitude yes. with all of the incredible food. That's Here's gorgeous. your taster for Yum. the ramen. Yum. So spicy miso <laughs> with all the benefits. I'll bring you some tea. These are my favorite <laughs> cookies. Oh, They're what are matcha those? matcha chocolate chip cookies mm. made with the same matcha love, but you fold them in with some bananas Yum. as a secret ingredient. And then you use high quality oh, dark wow. chocolate. Oh, that looks good. It's pretty good, right? I'm, and I'm amazing. glad that you have the tea, TJ, because um, you got to 
compare it. I'm holding on to I gotta to the get tea. you your tea, Amy. Right. Oh, wow. The rose it's full tea. Full service here, Candace. Thank you, you so much. Full service, <laughs> <Candace. Bye. laughs> Thank you so much for joining us and sharing this with us. We love it. And so for today's recipes, you can go to goodmorningamerica.com slash food, or you can scan the QR code that is on your screen right now. And be sure to check out Candace's many other recipes in King Sugi Wellness. Now, everywhere books are sold. Thank, Thank you, you again. We appreciate it. Yay. Hi, itadakimasu. Uh, <laughs> well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.